Alright guys, what's up? Voodoo51292 here. Uh, today is Thursday, February 17th of 2011, and uh, I'm coming to you from my dorm room, and I will be um, doing channel update number three today. Um, we have some more to talk about, about on some of the same lines as uh, we've talked about in the past, but updated. Um, we're going to talk about, again, Dead Space 2, where that's going, um, the stuff that's been going up on Call of Duty, and... Uh, some stuff about the ever approaching um, big, you know, basically giant launch day of my channel where I get the first game in, kills on three, and, and kind of kick off and really just play game after game after game all the way until the summertime. So uh, we'll be discussing a lot of those things today. Uh, the very first thing we're going to touch on is, uh, is Dead Space 2. Again, the only thing really I have new to say is, um, uh, as you probably know, the only thing that I have left to put up to complete Dead Space 2 is Dead Space Extraction. Um, now, uh, you'll notice that I think there's maybe five videos or so up there right now on uh, co-op extraction. Uh, Tyler and I played the first two chapters, I think one night, and then uh, basically it was toward the end of the week, so I went home, and when I came back, that was like two weeks ago, uh, all last week and all this week has just been absolutely ridiculous with the amount of work um, that we have to do for school. So. Neither one of us has really gotten the opportunity to sit down and play Extraction together. Um, and to be honest, after the first two chapters, uh, the game's alright, but we're not having a ton of fun with it just yet. Uh, it's kind of weird playing a rail shooter with PS3 controls, but we're hoping it gets better as we go. So, basically here's the deal. I said before that um, I wasn't going to do the, uh, the official game review of Dead Space 2 until Extraction was done. If extraction is not done in a timely manner, what do I mean by timely manner? I mean basically before everything starts with Killzone 3. Um, so, you know, if it's not done before I get Killzone 3, I'm going to say screw it. I'm going to make the game review for Dead Space 2 for campaign, multiplayer, and then what I have played and experienced of extraction thus far, wherever we are. Uh, extraction will get done, it will get put up eventually. I cannot tell you when because I have so many other things to do right now, it's just not, extraction's just not a priority for me right now, it's a little fun side thing, but I have so many loose ends to tie up and things I want to do before um, the giant, you know, channel game palooza uh, hits in March, that extraction's just not on the top of my list, I'll get it done when I can, um, again, if it's not done before that, that weekend, that first weekend in March, I'll make the game review anyway, um, regardless of where we are in extraction. So that's the deal with that. Black Ops, the videos that continue to come up are um, multiplayer. Uh, I went through the fifth set and then I said to myself, you know what, it's probably not a good idea to make a different playlist for every single different day I play this game because I'm going to be playing this game. I play, I've played it every day really for the past like two weeks. I just haven't filmed a lot during the week because it's in the dorm and it's kind of a pain to film all the multiplayer here in the dorm and how busy I've been, blah blah blah. So I like to do that at home. And I said basically, okay, after the fifth set, I'm going to make one more playlist that just says Call of Duty, Black Ops, Multiplayer, the rest. And basically everything I do from the fifth set onwards, however many matches I play, they'll all go on that playlist. Um, if that playlist hits a ridiculously high number of videos, I might make the rest part two. I don't know. But I'm not going to make a new set for every time I play. I'm just going to put them all on that playlist. I'll probably, each different day I play, I'll introduce and say, okay, you know, this is such and such a date so that you know when I switch but I'm not going to keep making different playlists it's too many um, the single player I didn't get I didn't start it when I thought I was going to start it because again I got wrapped up in the multiplayer every time I put in black ops multiplayer is what I want to play so uh, the black ops campaign is one that might get pushed during the summer uh, we have some stuff to talk about the summer and some filler games I want to do during the summer that may be one um, you know d depending again how much time I have over the next two weeks or so until uh, everything kicks off. We'll see. I don't know. Uh, so that's the deal with Black Ops. Um, so basically now uh, I want to talk about what's coming up. Basically the giant channel launch uh, where all these videos are going to start coming up and um, basically I'm going to get real busy and get to work. Um, and that's going to be the first game that's going to happen is Killzone 3. Now. Um, the game comes out February 22nd, in about five days or so from now. 
Uh, again, I'm, I'm not activating my Gamefly account though until March the 1st uh, so that I can save this month's payments and, and I'm not going to pay for one week of February uh, a whole month's pay. That, that's ridiculous. So I'm just going to wait the extra five or six days and then start March 1st and, and at least pay for a full month. Um, so the Gamefly account will go active March the 1st and on that day, March the 1st, it is a Tuesday and uh, I will be putting in my order for Killzone 3 on Tuesday, March the 1st. Now, when is the when is stuff supposed to get rolling? Uh, when should Killzone 3 footage begin going up? Um, I'm looking at the calendar here and again I'm activating my Gamefly account on Tuesday, March 1st uh, and putting in my order that day. Now, if you listen to Gamefly and read Gamefly, one of the biggest sell points for them is that they're very quick on getting you your game. You order the game and they say like it takes like um, you know two to three days to get the game to your house once you order it. Well, I have absolutely no trust in the mail at all. Um, based on my experiences with GameStop in the mail and uh, you know I just I don't have trust in that. I don't have trust in the regular mail service to deliver it that fast. However, uh, I'm sending my sites right now on Friday, March the 4th. So you can keep that date in mind because that day will probably be the day that um, Killzone 3 footage will begin going up. Um, or at least, let me put it to you this way. Killzone 3, I will probably begin playing March the 3rd. Again, the deal, I don't know if Killzone 3 videos will start going up March the 3rd. March the 4th, I'm sorry, March the 4th. Because I will be at home. And again, if, if you've watched some of my other stuff, I've mentioned this here and there. But the internet at my house sucks. Um, I have to use Wi-Fi through my laptop in my room. Uh, and uploading videos takes literally anywhere from 80 to 90 minutes per 15 minute video, which is absolutely absurd. And if I'm uploading, I can't play online, I can't do anything else. Obviously that probably won't be an issue for Killzone 3, uh, at least not when I'm playing the campaign. But, you know, to be honest with you, the actual footage of Killzone 3, I may put up a, a few videos overnight while I sleep or something like that, but I would expect the majority to start going up that Sunday night which would be March the 6th um, because Sunday night I'll come back to the dorm room where I can hook up my computer to an Ethernet cable and it takes 10 minutes to upload a 15 minute video instead of 90. Um, so I might put up the beginning videos on Friday night into Saturday, we'll have to see. Uh, but I would expect the majority of the videos to start really getting uploaded Sunday March 6th, um, Sunday night. Um, but again, it's only a hope for March the 4th because, again, with the mail, I don't, it should, it should absolutely, there's no reason it shouldn't be in by that weekend, you know, that Saturday, March the 5th, but we never know. So hopefully it's in by Friday and we can start playing. Now, I'm going to try to make a big deal out of it. I'm going to kind of pump the whole thing up and make it like a big channel launch, basically, um, because it is the first game. That I'm going to be playing, and then once I start kills on three years, game, 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 all the way until the summertime. So there's going to be pretty, pretty much constant footage from here. Uh, you know, it's been kind of slow for me lately. Uh, I've been putting up some videos here, some there, and they've all been Black Ops multiplayer, not a whole lot of variety because I just don't have a whole lot of variety to play right now. Um, you know, so. Um, it, it's going to be kind of a big deal. I'm going to try to make it a big deal and say. You know, look, here's the big launch of the channel. Basically, this is where it's all going to start. This is where the grind is going to start. And videos are going to start uploading. Um, that Friday, March the 4th, um, whether the game is in or not, I will probably make uh, a video that won't be a channel update or anything. It won't be part of a series. It'll just be a video uh, basically talking about the channel launch. Basically, coming on, getting excited, getting people excited for the channel. Basically updating you on Killzone 3, saying when I have it and when videos are going to start going up. And I'm going to break down basically the games I will be playing for the first half of the year. Uh, try to give you an idea of what order they'll be in. So that you kind of have a general outlook of what's going to take place here on the channel once things really start getting uh, uh, kicked off. So I'll make like kind of like a channel launch video uh, explaining everything um, to get people excited. Um, let me check how much time is. Alright, we have a little bit of time. So, um, basically, 
uh, to talk about a few things once my channel gets rolling, uh, which I'll address again in the launch video, but we'll save for now. Uh, anyway, um, if if you're getting interested in the channel, if you are liking what I'm seeing and you are anxious to see the stuff that's going to come starting in March, uh, all the way through. Um, it's going to be very, very important that you keep up to date on the channel update videos because, again, this is where I put all of my important information. Um, you know, anything at all that's really important, that's not important, that's updated information, everything that I need to say is going to go on these channel updates. So it's going to be really important that you keep up with the channel updates over the next three months so that you know what's going on, you know what I'm playing, you know if I'm having any issues, you know if I'm going to have to take a break or when videos are going to go up or what. It's going to be really important if you're interested in the channel to keep up with the update videos because um, that's how you're going to keep in touch. That's how you're going to know what's going on. Um, you know, this is my way of, of communicating to you and letting you know what's happening. So that's going to be important. Um, so that, that's, that's the note I have on, on what's coming up. Uh, I'm very excited um, to to get to playing and to start putting stuff up and hopefully start getting some uh, some real good views here on the channel. Um, and before we go and wrap up this update, I do want to uh, say a couple of things and make a couple of general notes on the channel itself and how it's going. Um, I've had the channel up for about a month now and uh, as of late, um, I have actually been receiving uh, a lot of personal, well, not a lot, you know, but uh, a few uh, actual personal messages from people um, telling me that they're liking my videos, um, which is pretty cool. Uh, some numbers, uh, I just hit uh, over 1,100 total upload views, and I'm inching towards 1,000 channel views. So when you talk about the, the fact that I have like 150 videos up, 1,100 total upload views might not be such a huge deal, but it does mean something and what it means is that people are watching the videos over 1100 times people are watching the stuff that I'm putting up which is great because exposure is what I need right now I need people to be watching the videos I need people to be commenting on them liking them subscribing I need the exposure right now to get the channel going to get people excited for what's going to be coming so 1100 total upload views and, and like 850 or so channel views. I think I'm up to like 12 subscribers now and, and maybe 8 friends or something like that. And again, I've been receiving messages from people who want me to go check out their videos, um, which obviously shows that they're interested in my opinions. Um, I've received messages saying, hey, look, we really like your videos. Um, I think this stuff's really good. Uh, which is making me feel real good right now, I have to say, because uh, that, that's the kind of stuff that I really enjoy seeing and would like to see start coming up is people who are watching the videos and who are enjoying them. Um, and people are, are now taking the time, instead of just clicking thumbs up or thumbs down, as the case may be, uh, they're actually taking the time to write comments on my videos, they're taking the time to write me messages, and, uh, and actually tell me uh, in their words uh, that they're enjoying my videos and that they'd like to see more. So um, that's getting me encouraged. Uh, I, I, you know, I, I've always felt that if I stuck with this and just kept going and just kept uploading and, and stuff like that, that it would catch on and people were going to start doing it. And it always starts with a few people. Um, so if you, if, if you guys who have been sending me these messages and have subscribed to me or keeping up with the channel regularly, thank you. I appreciate it. Um, I'd ask that you help me out by you know, kind of making my stuff public and, 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 and writing comments consistently and sending me messages consistently and stuff like that. Um, ask me questions, ask me anything you want, um, and spread the word out there. Um, and, and just keep up with my stuff and keep up with my, with my updates and uh, I really appreciate it. Um, so uh, I will go for now. This weekend there will probably be even more Black Ops multiplayer on the way. And um, another channel update will probably be coming out next week or something talking about where I am in preparations for the big launch of the channel, the, the, the games I need to tie up and stuff like that. I'll probably explain all of that in the next update. Uh, but we're running out of time, so uh, I'm going to cut it here. And uh, I will see you guys this weekend with more Black Ops multiplayer footage.